Funded by the U.S. Department of Education's Office of Special Education Programs and the Office of Elementary and Secondary Education, the Center on PBIS supports schools, districts, and states to build systems capacity for implementing a multi-tiered approach to social, emotional, and behavior support. The broad purpose of PBIS is to improve the effectiveness, efficiency, and equity of schools and other agencies. PBIS improves social, emotional, and academic outcomes for all students, including students with disabilities and students from underrepresented groups. This is the PBIS website. Let me give you a quick tour to show you how we've organized resources and how to quickly find the resource you're looking for. Resources on the website are divided between four main categories, tools, publications, and presentations and videos. In addition, the website features content on basic PBIS principles and how PBIS incorporates into broad topics relevant to educators. Rounding out the website are sections dedicated to our annual conference, the PBIS Leadership Forum, as well as information on the center itself, including information regarding people in your state who can help you with PBIS implementation. All right, back to the resources. Each section is divided into categories of resources. For example, you can see that beneath publications we have six categories, including all publications. Each category has a page that lists resources, starting with the most recent. You can also sort the list by topic and or keywords. Click a topic to bring up resources only for that topic. Here I have clicked on Classroom PBIS. To further sort the list, I can click on Tier 2 from the keywords to bring up only resources that pertain to publications having to do with Tier 2 Classroom PBIS. Clicking download brings me to a page specific to that resource. Here I can see all the information associated with it and a button to download the file. If you know which resource you need, the fastest way to find it is with the website search. Clicking the magnifying glass and type your search term in the search bar that appears. In this case, I'm looking for the TFI manual. I type TFI and press the return key on my keyboard. Here, I am presented with my search results. I can see that there are 14 resources related to the TFI and spot the TFI manual as the second in the list. Now let's say I'm looking for the PBIS Evaluation Blueprint. I could type that whole name into the search bar, but let's say I want to save time by just typing Blueprint. Or maybe I've forgotten the exact name of the resource, but remember that it is a Blueprint. I type Blueprint and click on Search. Here I see a list of every resource on the website with Blueprint in the name. The Evaluation Blueprint is the first in the list. I hope this tour has been helpful and that you visit pbis.org soon to try it out.